Okay, so uh, into the uh, officially this is our online class four on manager economics. So before starting today's class, uh, uh, I want to hear from you like do you have any problem regarding our last lecture and others? Inquiries chilo? Any problem at sir? No, ma'am. Uh, first four principal abong last year principal to tumam bhavo bhavo bhiste kore chhu. That's true. principal ek aasa chhe to bol leni and I have an announcement for you. Uh, like on on next class. That means amade next week je class ta hobe online class five. It will lecture two the. I am going to get a class test nite chhe. Uh, so. The syllabus will be about uh, the first two chapter. Aaj ke amar first chapter to shesh kore filbo. Amar already ke chapter complete kora shi from our first reference book and from the second reference book that is the uh, managerial economics by Mike Hershey. Or je first chapter je tamar start kore shi nature and scope of managerial economics. Ota shesh kore filbo. The fourth chapter to je the economic optimization is amar the next class me. Aaj ke ekko shuru kore next class ta continue kore. गुगल फर्म टू जयफुल जी मैडम सुनते पड़ते हैं। ओके तो डू यू हैव एनी प्रॉब्लम इफ आई टेक द क्लास ऑन गूगल क्लास टेस्ट ऑन गूगल गूगल फॉर्म। हाँ ना मैडम जेतो मन फर्स्ट या एग्जाम तो ना बुस्तु आते से ना तो तुम बोलते नहीं लोग शुभिदा होगे बाकी आप आशा भी चुके। सो इकहने मन है ऑन एक फर्स्ट ईयर फर्स्ट क्लसरूम देखो যেটাতে ওদের অলরেডি নিয়ে एग्जाम এইভাবে নিয়েছে তো আমি আমি जस्ट গো টু দ্য প্রিন্সিপাল অফ ইকোনমিক্স দিস ইজ দা দিস ইজ ওয়ান অফ মাই জিডি কোর্সেস হুইচ ইজ টেকেন বাই মি অন স্প্রিং সেমিস্টার ইটস मींस জেনারেল এডুকেশন কোর্সেস সো আই টুক देयर ক্লাস টেস্ট অন মোশাবলি মিস নট দা মিস্টার ক্লাস টেস্ট एग्जाम সো আই টুক देयर ক্লাস টেস্ট অন word file মানে আমি এই ক্ষেত্রে যেটা করি এটা তো আমি টিচার এন্ড থেকে দেখতে পাচ্ছি এটার বাইরে আমার কাছে দেখানোর কিছু নাই তো আমি ওদেরকে যেটা করেছি যে আমি ক্লাস টেস্টে নিয়েছি হচ্ছে যে গুগল ফর্মে সরি মানে আমি এই ক্ষেত্রে গুগল ডকে আপনারা যেটা বলছিলেন যেটা বলছেন সেটা আমি যেটা করি তখন সেই ক্ষেত্রে আই আপলোডেড এ পোরশন এটা ওয়ার্ড ফাইলে হতে পারে একটা পিডিএফ ফাইলে হতে পারে যেমন ফার্স্ট ক্লাস টেস্ট একটা পিডিএফ ফাইলে ছিল क्षेत्र তো এরকম দেখবেন যে গুগল ক্লাসরুমে একটা সার্টেন টাইমে ইওর কোশ্চেন উইল বি আপলোডেড আফটার দ্যাট আপনাকে কি করতে হবে কোশ্চেনটা পাওয়ার পরে জাস্ট অ্যানসার ইট এন্ড ডোন্ট ডু এনি প্লাগারিজম দেন জাস্ট মেক শিওর যে আপনি হচ্ছে গিয়ে অ্যানসারটা করার পরে এটা আপনি যে কোনো ফর্মে করতে পারেন লাইক ইন দা ওয়ার্ড ফাইল 
or after the monahaja to work file, a type for a submit for the Naki Shetako put the pattern after Judy Monahaja Naki Kata Ligan handwritten Shetakurama case as to check a chobicula party given at the Shetako put the pattern. I'm young student, they kept it to the other or a kiki cover chili, Pahlamiki clearly both the purple. So maximum do this thing that means the write down on on a class lecture then convert it on PDF file and then upload it on my Google Classroom. Convert the code say, even amateur instruction day, you can have to do the Katai Liki for and the Google form and Google form and pull up ID and others submit for a Jagger duty. Google form is here tonight. Just a me can you see it upon a post code name, ID, your name, ID, post code, and the name of the place. It is a lickable and date. It will be then at the answer for that. Ebon, Johan PDF to convert for an event or a camp scanner be a core. I know the software name is camp scanner. So, shop bullet show me to like camp scanner in media would accept PDF to convert for the file become March. So, try patch by the page if you have a chill, but if the camp scanner be a color for it, it's a March file academy. If you have a chill, it's a file chaplet for this. এবং ফাইলে নেমিং করা যায় নেমিং তে চেষ্টা করবে নাম দিতে ম্যানেজার ইকোনমিক্স ক্লাস টেস্ট 1 এরকম মানে জাস্ট ইমেজ 1 2 3 এভাবে করে না দিয়ে ম্যানেজার ইকোনমিক্স ক্লাস টেস্ট 1 বা তার নেম দিয়ে ক্লাস টেস্ট 1 এভাবে দিবে যাতে কোনো ভাবে যদি ফাইলটা মিসিং হয়ে যায় আমি কিন্তু পাই আচ্ছা এখানে আরেকটা ছিল যেটা হচ্ছে কি উনি এই যে টিভা উনি যেটা করেছেন উনি কিন্তু ওয়ার্ড ফাইলে সাবমিট করেছেন এটাই দেখাতে যাচ্ছি उन्हें वर्डे लिखे थे नहीं देखे थे ना वर्डे लिखे जस्ट हम उसको तो सबमिट कर दिए थे जी मैम सो अम्म 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 Google Form or Google Docs, just submit it on me, then that will be okay for me. But uh, most probably our beaten, there will be two sessions. Uh, one is by uh, one is uh, assignment for 24 hours, and another one is time constant assignment. In that time, I'm bound to uh, take the exam on Google Form. So, Tokon Ami Abaiko Google Form, we share the Dishi people who shape her up an exam. अच्छा जी को ओपन करो जब तो गूगल फॉर्म तो देखा जो गूगल फॉर्म में एग्जाम टा कैम होना है इतने आप में दे वो भावे सुनो आह ऐसे दीदे हो बना अच्छा आराग तो जिन्हें शोकुनी गूगल फॉर्म में अच्छा आमी आराग तो क्लासरूम में जिकने आमी एस ए स्टूडेंट ना अच्छे शे क्लासरूम मेटेरियल स्टूडेंट हिसाब से इनफरमेशन आते हैं I am assigned to seven students because I have a practice set of questions. So, I have a student that I have to do with assignment. So, I have to click on the view assignment. And then, I hope that you will click on the class assignment. I 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 will click on the class assignment. So, I will click on the class assignment. जो आपके की की कोट पे होगे, मैं क्वेश्चन तो देखे नहीं लाम, सपोज दिस इज माय क्वेश्चन, इटा कॉलर पड़े, आमा के जेटा आमी जेकाच्चा कोर्बो, 
ওই ধরেন আমি ওয়ার্ড ফাইল এ করেছি বা আমি নিজে একটা এক্সেল ফাইল জেনারেট করে অবভিয়াসলি আমি একটা এক্সেল ফাইল ওপেন করে এখান থেকে দেখে আমি অ্যানসারটা করে নিতে পারি করার পরে এই যে ইওর ওয়ার্ক ইন দা রাইট সাইড টপ কর্নার উই ক্যান সি देयर इज अ অপশন व्हिच इज ইওর ওয়ার্ক ইউ हैव टू क्लिक ऑन देयर एंड देयर इज देयर इज अ प्लस साइन एंड देयर इज अ অপশন दैट इज ऐड और क्रिएट जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दैट so when you click on that there will be first of all there will be three option google drive link and file so if you want you can share something from your google drive and that means already the file is in your, in your google drive apni oi je bolchilam je just apni ek random khatai liklen likhe eta ke pdf e convert kore nilo ota kintu apnar mobile e google drive e je add hobe আপনি চাইলে ওখানে আপলোড করে দিতে পারেন ওখান থেকে আপনি এখানে নিয়ে আসতে পারেন আপনি ধর মোবাইলে এখানে লিংক নাই তারপরও আমি আমার আমি আমার গুগল ড্রাইভ থেকে মোবাইলে গুগল ড্রাইভে আপলোড দিয়ে দিয়েছি আমি সেখান থেকে কিন্তু আপনি নিতে পারবেন আমার কাছে মনে হলো যে আমি এটা একটা ডক ফাইলে লিখেছি সো ইন দ্যাট কেসেস देयर উইল বি এ লিংক জেনারেটেড উইথ দা ডক ফাইল আমি লিংকটা তো ক্লিক করে দিতে পারবো আমি जस्ट একটা ফাইল আপলোড করে দেখাবো এন্ড দা থার্ড অপশন হুইচ ইজ ফাইল সো ইফ আই ক্লিক this button it will go to the uh, local drive to my uh, laptop or my computer so i just click on the browse option uh, so finally this is the last uh, uh, folder i have open that's about my research article i'm working on a research article so that's why it's open suppose i me this i download se gaye chen okhan theke ekta kichu korte chaichi so i me suppose eta diye dena copu syllabus for csc सबमिट कर रिजल्ट which means আমার কিন্তু এটা অলরেডি সেভ হয়ে গেছে আপনারা যদি মনে হয় হয় না আমি আরেকবার ক্লিক করে দেখাচ্ছি সো দেখেন আমি যতটুকু এডিট করেছিলাম এটা কিন্তু এখানে অল আচ্ছা নেট কানেকশন থাকলে এটা অলরেডি অ্যাড হয়ে গেছে इट्स अ वेरी इजी অপশন दैट्स व्हाই আই শো ইউ দ্যাট তো আমি এটা ক্লোজ করে দিলাম সো আমার গুগল শিটে এটা হয়ে গেছে এখন যদি আমার মনে হয় যে আই আম ডান আই ওয়ান্ট টু সাবমিট ইট টু মাই কোর্স টিচার সো আমি এখানে টার্ন ইন অপশনটা ক্লিক করব টার্ন ইন অপশনটা ক্লিক করলে আমার টিচারের কাছে আমার এই টাস্কটা চলে যাবে তো আমি এটা টার্ন ইন করব বিকজ इट्स नॉट মাই দা ডিজায়ার টাস্ক দে ওয়ান্ট সো এখন এমনও হলো যে আপনি ভুল ফাইল অ্যাড করে ফেলেছেন হোয়াট ইউ ক্যান ডু देयर দ্যাট কেস ইজ जस्ट ক্লিক অন দা ক্রস বাটন সো আই ক্লিক দা ক্রস বাটন সো इट्स बिकम আনসার আমি সবগুলো একটু ক্রস বাটন প্রেস করে দিলাম সো এটা কিন্তু চলে গেল সাপোজ আমার কাছে মনে হলো আমি एग्जाम দিলাম দেওয়ার পরে মনে হলো যে টিচার কে একটা ইনফরমেশন দেওয়া দরকার তখন আপনি এই যে অ্যাড এ প্রাইভেট কমেন্ট এখানে হচ্ছে গিয়ে আপনি ক্লিক করলে পাবেন আমি এখন করতে পারছি না বিকজ হচ্ছে গিয়ে আই ডিডেন্ট আপলোড এনি ফাইল হিয়ার ইফ আই আপলোডেড এ ফাইল দিস অপশন উইল বি এনাবল ফর মি দেন আই ক্যান সেন্ড সাম টেক্সট টু মাই কোর্স টিচার সো হোয়েন হোয়েন ইউ আর ডান জাস্ট ক্লিক অন দিস বাটন দ্যাট ইজ মার্ক অ্যাজ ডান অর টার্ন অন সো দ্যাট your copy is submitted to your class teacher if you don't press this button that is mark as done or turn on in that cases i will not get any answer suppose ami ara ekbar dekhache i open a doc file ami eta doc file mane google er jeta word file bole that's called the google doc ami eromota doc file open korlam je je khane ami answer ta dicchi 
after that it has become turn in so when you click on this button that is turn in which means your course teacher will get your answer am i clear to you so it's very important after you do this i can control it my course teacher will not get anything when i turn in that button button then my course teacher will get that yes lila has submitted uh, this assignment and blah 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 okay so jodi google form e nei shei khetre apnar ei bhabei option ta ashbe ekhane google form ta dekhte parben ebong seta complete korar pore just press this button that is uh, mark as done okhane tokhon button ta thakbe mark as done mark as done press korbo othoba jodi ami onno kono form e dei pdf and others ei khetre uh, when you uploaded the file here then just click on the button that is start so i will get the answer okay sir madam any more yes, question yes. about uh, the google form so google form hole ki hobe amar ekhane jeto google form nai ami eta ei bhabe dakhate parchi na mane amar end theke as a student ami kono class e join korachi shekhane ami exam diyechi google form e je excel e ache bole eta dakhate parchilam তো সেই ক্ষেত্রে যেটা হবে যে গুগল ফর্ম এখানে লেফট সাইডে তখন দেয়ার উইল বি অপশন গুগল ফর্ম আপনি এটাকে ক্লিক করলেই হচ্ছে কি আপনি গুগল ফর্মে ওপেন হয়ে যাবে ওখানে অ্যান্সার করে আসবেন করার পর ওটা সাবমিট করবেন করার পরে এই যে রাইট সাইডে তখন এই যে মার্ক এস ডা এই বাটনটা থাকবে জাস্ট প্রেস দা বাটন দ্যাট ইজ মার্ক এস দা তাহলে আপনার হচ্ছে যেমন আমি একটু করেই দেখি এটা করলে তার উপর কোনো সমস্যা নেই আমি যদি এটাকে এখন মার্ক এস ডা করি এই যে আমাকে দেখাচ্ছে ইউ ডিডেন্ট অ্যাটাচ ওয়ার্ক ফর দা টাস্ক সাবমিশন হ্যাঁ Uh, that uh, your teacher will just see so is it done am okay she question korche je ami ki ashole dite chacchi kina so ami jodi ekhon tar por mark as done press kore dei tale amar teacher kintu ami kichu na koreche tar por dekhte bolo je ami kichu ekta submit koreche ekhon ami mark as done button ta press korechi so that's about the google form or uh, google uh, google doc uh, class test uh, how will i am going to take your uh, first class uh, first class test and the midterm examination so for google form uh, i will upload it a form there acha ar ekbar ekta dekhi ni ashi i will upload it a form there so that uh, you have to click on that button and the google form will be open then just write down your answer there and then come back to your google uh, after completing it come back to your google classroom and press uh, press on this button that is mark as done and if i take the class test as uh, like uh, any word file or any other files in that cases you have to upload the file from this option that is from your work option and when you click on this button that is the add or create so you you can add the file from your laptop or your local device or you can add the file from google drive or you can create in any of this like google doc google sheet google drawings drawings means if you want to draw something in that case just click on the drawings option so that uh, a drawings uh, uh, slide will open and you can draw uh, some, sometimes we need to draw some figures so that you can add from google drive আমি যেটা করি সাধারণত আমাদের যদি আমি আর একটা ওয়ার্কশপে অ্যাটেন্ড করেছি ওয়ার্কশপ মানে কোর্সের জন্য আমাকে কিছু কোর্স করতে হয়েছে সো ইন দ্যাট টাইম আই হ্যাভ টু ড্র লটস অফ ফিগার সো আই অ্যানসারড एवरीथिंग অন গুগল ডক দ্যাট मींस আ ওয়ার্ড ফাইল এন্ড আই অ্যাটাচেস एवरी ফিগার আই ড্র দ্যাট ফিগার অন গুগল ড্রয়িংস এন্ড আই অ্যাটাচেস উইথ উইথ টু মাই কোর্স টিচ যখন আমি তো দেখাই দু গুগল ডকটা আমি ওপেন করে যে আমরা দেখতে পাচ্ছি যে you can see a google doc file is creating there and it's already open suppose just i want to write down like uh, first last test of mbs 405 that's your uh, that's your course code so my grammarly open with this grammarly will help you to find out any kind of grammar problem so i i just turn on uh, turn on it so that i will find automatically uh, that will check my um, any any kind of grammatical mistake so suppose i'm done with my google doc that means whatever i want to write here so just i close it so whatever i'm writing it's already saved here suppose i want to draw a figure i told you earlier so that i will open another folder which is drawings 
So again, the Google Drawings is creating. Okay, when the creation is done, just click on there and your Google Drawings slide will open and you can draw anything here. So you can actually draw for the purple. I'm just you know, like to open having a web page. So already the arrow is selected. So if I click there, I'm going to click on the box, click on the box, and box click on the box. So I'm going to click on the box, 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 so, if you have a problem, I am a drawing still shaken or color. So, I'm at a close to the data can be saved. So, when now, if you I just uh, click on the button that is turning, so that again my class teacher will find out my uh, work. So, it is a good shop to easy way. So, the Amar Monahaj and Ami Havadika Chachina, she can come out the way bullet to upload any file from the from your local device. So she can put them up the That's it. So I'm just going to submit for one. It's not my task. So I'm going to place for a dinner. So they can grab the person and assign for it. Even back in, I'm going to put it. See, talking to them about turning off from the turning off from the people of the set. And it has become again marked as done. So I want to go see if I uploaded the question on Google Forms. In that case, there will be no option for file upload. Just you have to click on that. Google form and answer over there. And whenever you are done, uh, just come to your Google Classroom and uh, turn on this option that is the mark as done so that I will get your answer. And uh, what can I say? You are not late. Uh, you are not late. And I'm going to go to the answer and properly. Otherwise, I'm going to take an answer. I'm a Google, I'm a as a teacher, and I'm going to shut up. So now let's talk about today's class. So in today's class, I will complete the chapter one uh, from our second reference book. And I already shared this with you. In, sec uh, in second, in this chapter, we will get to know about the uh, economic profit versus accounting profit, business profit versus economic profit. Then we will, uh, we will get to know about some legal constraint in our business. Uh, when we start a business, uh, we will find out some legal constraints. So what are those? We will get to know about that. Or uh, I can say there are some limitation in form, so we will get to know about that. And the first model we're going to develop from a managerial economics, that is the uh, theory of farm. So we, we will get to know about that and we will do a simple map from here that, that is to find out the expected present, uh, expected future value from the uh, uh, from the given present value. Uh, so uh, for that purpose, I, I made a simple slide and I I think I already shared this slide with you on your Google Classroom. So from that slide, we already know that uh, the, the scope of managerial economics is uh, versatile. That means when we want to do something like on uh, arts and social science, that means we want to apply our, <coughs> sorry. <coughs> sorry. So uh, when uh, we want to apply our ideas in arts and science subject, we can use managerial economics. Uh, in managerial economics, we use the concept of microeconomics, that is the individual economic activities. And when we, uh, when, when we want to use that ideas in broad area, that means in policy level, policy implication level, then we can uh, use that. So another scope is used in macroeconomics, then we can use it on the multidisciplinary uh, 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 purposes. So it, it um, the area of interest of managerial economics is it's versatile. So then we get to know about what is managerial economics. So it's very easy thing that is the economic knowledge you need to uh, know as a manager. And um, just I told you the in first class. So and from your book, uh, from the bookish the definition is like managerial economics is the uh, is a it's a course which is the blend blend uh, which is a mixture of 
uh, economic theory, which is microeconomics and macroeconomics, and it will use the tools that uh, it will use some tools uh, which is like uh, which is from the data science uh, like the manage mathematical economics and econometrics and this is the mixture of these two things that is the economic theory and data science uh, then we will use it to organize our uh, managerial activities and we will try to achieve our aims and objectives most efficiently using this idea using the idea uh, using the ideas we're getting from the manual economics we will try to uh, organize and achieve our uh, activities so that's managerial economics uh, then let's go for some examples suppose you want to establish a uh, farm so how many worker you are going to recruit or what would be their salaries or what would be your maximum profit or how you can survive in that market or if you want to uh, build up a uh, like uh, non-profit organization like hospital or an ngo or a educational institute in that case is what would be your activities to maintain that and uh, really do you uh, can you, uh, can we make some profit from this kind of uh, non-profit organization so this sort of question, to, uh, to find out the answer of this sort of question, we can use the manual economics. So, so for example, I mean, uh, like Shagor from my class, he wants to establish a, a business and he doesn't have enough money to establish that business. So in this course, so we will uh, find out uh, the cost of the production. In next chapter, I will discuss about the cost of production. So, Shekhan, I'm going to see that the business has started the amount he needs. It is actually profitable if he go for uh, bank loans. I'm going to see that. And invest in how many days he can repay the loan or like what would be the uh, what would be the total revenue so that he can make some profit and calculation below so here i'm doing some calculation not uh, i'm using the economic theory again in this uh, chapter we will talk about the some legal concern in business uh, to uh, understand that you need some economic knowledge so all are related with your business activities so, we have to say that 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 we have to so here, Amy means manager economics. I took that just. I took the initial. So economics actually deals with the all body of principle. That is, it will deals with the ten principle. I talk about the ten principles and I elaborately explain the first four principle. And I told you that uh, I would like to make a conceptual question from those that part. So whatever it, whatever the principle is. Economics will, will deal with the principles. That means everything about that principle, like its application, analysis, uh, policy making from those principles, everything is, everything is discussed under economics. But when we talk about managerial economics, the interesting thing is that it will deal with only the application of those principles. So for example, when I talk about trade can make everyone better off, from that part I told you that uh, when we go for a trade with USA, that can be find out from this principle. So I, I was talking about the application, not about the, uh, the about the principle or uh, 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 the policy we can make from it. Or like, when USA said the trade, which there are some uh, trade barrier, non-trade barrier. I didn't talk about that because those are some policy thing. But I talk about only one thing that is how we can make trade or how the trade will be beneficial uh, from uh, 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 how the trade will be beneficial when uh, we go for the uh, RNG production and USA go for the computer production. So I just, I go to a specific thing. That means that uh, uh, I, uh, I can say, I, I talk about the application thing. How can we apply out uh, on our uh, real life? So main thing is that managerial economics will 
discuss about the application of those principle uh ma economics actually talk about microeconomics macroeconomics both that's why we say characteristics of both which means it will talk about the individual economic activities uh, which means micro and obviously the economy as a whole which means macro but managerial economics actually micro in nature that means it will discuss about only the individual economic activity that is what i am going to do as a manager but that means it's only self centered thing bujhte parchi managerial economics kintu mane whole principle gulo niye kotha bolbo na just self centered ekhane ami self centered hobo ebong self centered anything is a goes under micro economics अकॉर्डिंग ever based on any kind of assumption amra joto tukoi pori na keno dekhben je ami kono assumption e jabo na i will discuss about the practical uh, situation uh, uh, about it uh, so ekhane kintu ashole amra kono assumption e jacche just i we discuss about the practical situation uh, and uh, actually uh, we can say the uh, the application of those assumption manual economics will talk about the application of those assumption okay so uh, in economics different type of theories are studied like uh, i am a students from economics background so i studied about health economics development economics agriculture economics but managerial economics only focus on one thing that is a specific process that is what a manager would uh, do when he started a, a sort of venture so this is our main focusing thing that means we will not discuss about health economics here or uh, urban economics here or agriculture economics it only focus on one thing that is what a manager will do what a manager will do that's it so it focuses only one project that means about the managers okay and, the, and then the last thing that is economics is Uh, is both type that is is normative and positive it follows the normative and positive side okay normative uh, economics and policy ta kena amra dui to bhage bhag korte pari acha one is normative and another one is positive normative means uh, the those policies will goes with the norm which we practice norm means the ethical values we uh, we get from our society or our culture so when it the policy is goes with the norm then it's called normative uh say for example in ramadan in ramadan the price level increases in bangladesh to be honest it can it it cannot explain any of the policies i have studied uh throughout my msc and bsc life who know theories they it can explain kara jana je why in a sort of time in bangladesh the price level increases like in the ramadan time before the ramadan or before the eid even before this lockdown the uh, the price level was too high the uh, everything jete kinte jabe na kono dekhe price pere giyechhe kan ke jane je lockdown dicche so we will purchase a lot of thing उट always we think about ourselves so that it happens i mean it actually it should be it not only in bangladesh in subcontinent this kind of unethical practice happens it up the malaysia the jen okhane kintu ora ei rokom but bangladesh eta pabe and positive science means in that cases the policy can be explained by the data and the inform uh, the information available for us so that's called positive science 
So for example, it's a very common thing when the price is up, our demand is down. At higher price, we uh, consume less product or we purchase less product. So that's a positive sign. If we take 100 people as a sample size, uh, from there we can find out maximum like the 90 percent uh, 90 people will say yes when the price is high they purchase less thing so this kind of uh, like uh, it's called the law of demand like when the price is up demand is down if other things remaining same when the price is up demand is down so this is the law of demand so it comes from the part that is positive science that means uh, it, uh, it's scientifically proven so mainly uh, when we discuss about economics, it will talk about both normative and positive science. But mainly managerial economics discuss about normative. Yeah, it doesn't go with the scientific uh, uh, positive science. That means a scientifically proven thing. It's actually talk about the norms, uh, the ethical, uh, uh, ethical uh, uh, your ethical code and conduct, your behavior, consumer behavior, uh, producer behavior, it, 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 this will discuss about that thing. That means what you will do in, uh, in the critical situation. It's not discuss about the, what will happen scientifically in this kind of sort of process. So I, these are some basic difference between them. In Google, you will find Madam, out the difference. Yes, one answer. Madam, we have positive science to the part of the bulletin. Normative science means it's not scientifically proven. And positive science means it's scientifically proven. It's scientifically proven, but it's positive science. So, when the price is up, demand is down. It's scientifically proven. Because you have 100 samples in our class, there are 16, 15 students. We have to say that the price is up, the price is up, the price is up, the price is up. Yes, ma'am. Okay, I'm a prize will be shaking it. So that can be taken to prove for us. I mean, G data gulo patch, G information gulo patch. I can prove it using those information. So this is positive science. But I'm a Judy bully in Ramadan or the start of Ramadan, the price level increases in Bangladesh. Can we scientifically proven that? That can go to when I have to build a bar, but not to build a bar, madam, Bangladesh here to be high. ठीक ना हमने इका थरे बोल बोलना तो मांगला देश आमला भालो ना मेरा हमने इटा कुडी इर बाहर एक ना उधर बालर किसे थके ना डेट मीन्स इटा आमी कुछ किधे एक्सप्लेन बोलते चुदे एक्सप्लेन करने डेट मीन्स इटा ही आमदन नॉम ना हमने इटी मेंटेन कोट सी तो दैट इस दैट इस नॉर्मेटिव नॉर्मेटिव साइंस so economics तो शायद हम तो बहुत part में deal करे but या true normative part में dealing करा part का कम है जो managerial economics then development studies इधर होने कोर्स कुलों ते हमने शायद हम तो normative science कुलों ने बेशक आगे चुना कोरे बाकी part गुलो हमने शायद हम तो positive science की कथा बोली अने theories गुलो data रूपर base कोरे हमने develop कोरे but अच्छा managerial economics का ना normative ना normative science इट आशी यान बांग्लादेश जो जो एक तो अगी बोला हम जब हमारे ने price level बढ़ा चुके इधर तो आमी अपनी बढ़ा चुकी ना किचु producer बढ़ा चुके that means they are they are organizer in their own business organizer means they are the manager of their own business so it's their decision to increase the price before Ramadan so you can scientifically explain it rather you can explain it using the uh, their ethical code of conduct their ethics says yeah before ramadan you should uh, increase the price level so that's why maximum activities actually the most of the activities of uh, our the policies in manual economics can be explained by normative thing that is the normative science that's why they say Manual economics mostly focuses on the normative side. Okay, so now let's talk about uh, now, now let's talk about why the managerial economics is helpful. I'm not going to talk about it, just I'm going to talk about it. Suppose for your future business, what would be your uh, 
managerial behavior or what would be the consequences of that managerial behavior it, it will be explained easily by this uh, this a uh, part of economics that means the managerial economy so that's why it's helpful for us like ami ei course theke ami ami eitar kotha nai boli ami amar class ta ke jokhon organize kori i have learned so many things from this course how to dealing with my customer that means uh, you are the student how to dealing with them uh, how to ma make my class more effective i have learned those thing from my class so that's why i find this course very a uh, useful thing i i didn't learn it from the health economics course or i didn't learn it from the urban economics so health economics only discuss about the health things urban economics discuss about the economic activities in urban area but what i should do as a manager here i am the classroom manager so what i should do as a classroom manager what would be our behavior, uh, my behavior and what would be its economic consequences i have learned this thing from my class so as a manager if you hire more labor what would be its economic consequences or if you hire well, uh, if you purchase lots of capital if you go for a, a large amount of loan what would be its consequences and how you can overcome that situation this kind of sort of answer you will find out from this course so that's why i can say it's a very useful thing for your day to day life so now let's see how a manager solve its um, uh, uh, solve his problem using the ideas from manager so first of all uh, we face some managerial decision problem amra kichu problem face kori like ami ekdom simple at a problem bollam je when i try to start a business uh, the first thing come up to my mind that is should i invest on labor or in capital that means should i in uh, purchase more machinery tool or should i uh, per, uh, should i hire lots of labor to make my product so i make a problem face for now so then when i face the problem or we face the problem uh, as a manager there are two option for us that is first of all try to explain it using the economic theory and then apply it using the uh, uh, decision science or data science so what my economic theory says so in this situation actually economics in macroeconomics they says that find out how to produce মানে কিভাবে তৈরি করব এরকম একটা क्वेश्चन আছে how to produce mainly related with the uh, factors of production that means the labor capital land so it says that if the economy we, uh, uh, the economy we belong like uh, like we belong to bangladesh economy so uh, the economy we belong find out uh, what then what type of centric economy it is that means is it labor intensive or capital intensive so for example bangladesh is capital intensive country we use more capital sorry labor intensive country we use more labor in our country to produce goods and services because labor is cheap here so it's it would be beneficial for us if we go for labor intensive production so already amra kintu economic theory theke answer ta peye jacchi then you uh, um, I, I, another thing is decision science you uh, find out the answer or uh, analyze the answer from the decision science এক্ষেত্রে আমাদের কিছু টুলস থাকে আমরা কিছু ম্যাথমেটিক্যাল অ্যাপ্লিকেশন মানে আমরা কিছু ম্যাথস করে দেখতে পারি আমরা আজকে সেটাতে একটা দেখব এক্সপেক্টেড ফিউচার ভ্যালু এরকম এরকম আমরা কিছু ম্যাথমেটিক্যাল সলিউশনে যেতে পারি যখনই আমরা এই দুটোকে মার্চ করব দেন when uh, we use the uh, application of economic theory and we uh, solve uh, uh, the problem from the <coughs> decision science we will find out the solution so in this way managerial economics will help you to find out the optimum so optimal solution acha one more thing madam what is optimal solution optimal solution means just allow me sometime i will i would like to draw a figure so optimal solution means i'm at just at a figure drop out see so be at see that optimal solution means suppose i just draw a offer curve eta naam hocche offer curve eta apata to bujhte hobe na so there is a point ami dekhen ekta point indicate korlam just mark korchi 
একটা স্টার্ট পয়েন্ট দেখালাম এটা এন্ড পয়েন্ট দেখালাম सपोज द स्टार्टिंग पॉइंट इज ए and the ending point is b so from the a to b point uh, okay fine in y axis here we show the cost and x axis here we show the uh, year <clears throat> so when we start from this figure so already we can make profit from the uh, we, we are starting to see profit from the a point and it will end on the b point just am eta bojhao dorkar nei just bujhi je ekta figure jekhane a point theke amader profit ta start hao shuru korbe b point e je motamoti amader profit jeta ache seta theke shesh hoye jabe er por amra dekha jabe je ar profit ta pabo na cost er against e amar revenue er obhabe ashbe na so that uh, here you will find out a point where you can use <coughs> most efficiently your scare resources that scare resources which is limited in number so here you will find out a point where you can use your uh, yeah you can efficiently use your scare resources that means you will get the maximum output from it that's called the optimal situation optimal mane hocche amar je scare resource ta thake ota theke ami maximum output it's not the maximum point ami to ekhane maximum point e je ekhon je ekhon spotlight niye jacchilo okhane nite parcha so ওটা কিন্তু আসলে আমার অপটিমাম পয়েন্ট না অপটিমাল পয়েন্ট না ওটা হচ্ছে আমার ম্যাক্সিমাম পয়েন্ট হোয়ার আই ক্যান গেট দ্য ম্যাক্সিমাম বেনিফিট বাট এমনও হতে পারে হোয়েন আই গেট দ্য ম্যাক্সিমাম বেনিফিটস মে বি আই ক্যান ইউজ অল অফ মাই রিসোর্সেস এফিসিয়েন্ট সো যখনই আমি আমার রিসোর্সেস এফিসিয়েন্টলি ইউজ করব দ্যাট এন্ড আই উইল গেট দ্য ম্যাক্সিমাম আউটপুট দ্যাট কল অপটিমাল পয়েন্ট so like ami amar class er kotha jodi boli today i can use uh, i uh, my optimal uh, i can reach to my optimal point because ajke amar input bhalo na ami nije bujhte parchi ektu por por kharap lagche mane i am sick i told you already so ami kintu ajke already bhalo feel korchhe so i already i know i can reach to the optimal point today but uh, already, uh, still i am conducting the class so economics ideas so first of all you have to face the problem you will find out some problems uh, then go to the uh, economic theory that means the uh, eco application of economic theory like the microeconomics and macroeconomics uh, then find out the solution from there and analyze it from the data science your ideas from data science then um, uh, when you apply the uh, economic theory and analyze it from the uh, from the uh, ideas from data science you will find out uh, the optimal solution for you so for example i just uh, told you earlier i uh, we want to start a new business so first thing we come up to our mind should we go for the labor intensive production or capital intensive production so our economic theory says that bangladesh is a labor intensive country that means labor is very much cheap here so we should uh, follow this so we should go for labor intensive production then we if we use the uh, ideas from data science the revenue calculation and the total cost can calculation and then the find out the profit that is the total revenue minus total cost so we will find out if we go for the labor Uh, intensive production so the total cost will be lower than other that means the capital intensive production so it's it would be more beneficial for us if we go for labor intensive production so it is our decision amra jeta chole ashlam and applying then we can get the optimal solution so now let's build up the first theory in uh, managerial economics that is the theory of farm Ma mainly uh, the theory of farm focuses on the uh, our primary goal in uh, in a farm like uh, the 
profit maximization, the wealth maximization, and find out the value of that firm. That's the, that's the primary focusing on the theory of firm. So first of all, we will get to know about the expected future value. So this says that expected future value is the sum of present future value uh, given to you, uh, pre uh, present future uh, uh, value given to you. So say for example, here PV means the present future value. And this says uh, that your expected future value will be maximized when you sum up the expected future profit simultaneously. So say for example, here this pi sign, a pi sign to both the hoche profit in economics, I'm to leave that high. In economics, when you uh, we use this sign, this is called pi. Uh, we know that it has a value that is 3.1416. In mathematics, it has a value. But in economics, we use pi to use profit. So, we use pi to use profit. So, we profit. So, we use pi to use profit. So, we use pi to use profit. So, we use pi uh, 31416 so uh, let's find out uh, what is r r means here the rate of interest or the rate of return this small r means the rate of interest or rate of return it will be given you to uh, you, you to in a percentile form and you have to convert it in on decimal and one means the, the uh, number of uh, here the number of year is one two means the number of year is two then uh, n means uh, we took the nth number of years so if we have a child or soon to watch your children to get a party one, two, three, four, five. Jai kono bhot three jodi jana karna, amra ekhon bhi jete pare. number of years ta kuche pabe. So again, uh, I want to mention expected future value maximization means here we will find out the expected future value and uh, 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 that's the sum of the present. Um, uh, in that cases, uh, if this is the um, the present value is the sum of future profit expected future profit that we're going to make so that's why the formula has become like this that is the present value pv is equal to pi one suppose here, here we have nth number of year so that's why the present value pv is equal to pi one divided by one plus r to the power one plus pi two plus uh, divided by one plus r to the power r uh, in, in the same way, we can go for the nth number of years. So pi n uh, divided by one plus r to the power n. So we know when we want to use, uh, uh, when, when there is nth number of time and number of years, we can use this symbol that is the summation. It means the total sum, total So we can use the, this symbol that is summation and uh, the present value will be uh, pi t that means the number of total year uh, divided by one plus r to the power t just write down this two formula this the formula that we have done here in connection i'm going to connect a math score So I hope you already write down those. So Amra Ami Ami Hunter Math School Bo Apna Hate to leak the hobby copy code, but then we are going to solve that. So I'm a math bolt see just to leak it, huh? 
আমি একটু বলছি জাস্ট এটা কপি করি এটা হচ্ছে এটা না আমি জাস্ট এটা ওপেন করলাম এটা একটা एग्जांपल আমার স্লাইডে দাও ছিল আমি এখন বলবো সেটা আমরা সলভ করব এন্ড উই উইল ফাইন্ড আউট দা প্রেজেন্ট ভ্যালু সো ওখানে থেকে আমরা বুঝবো যে ফিউচারে অ্যাকচুয়ালি আমার যে থিওরি অফ আমি যে ফার্স্ট কথা দ্যাট ইজ আমার প্রেজেন্ট ভ্যালু যেটা এটা হবে হচ্ছে আমার ফিউচারে যে এক্সপেক্টেড ভ্যালু গুলো আছে এক্সপেক্টেড प्रॉफिट গুলো আছে সরি দিস ইজ দা সাম অফ মাই প্রেজেন্ট ভ্যালু আমরা ওটা ফাইন্ড আউট করব so this is the match from present value it is so like an at a discount rate of 7.5% <clears throat> just write down at a discount rate of 7.5% at a discount rate of 7.5% at a discount rate of 7.5% the value of a farm the value of a farm gener uh, uh, the value of a farm generates the value of a farm generates 50 dollar profit at first year 50 dollar profit at first year 100 dollar profit for second year and 100 and 150 dollar profit for third year So again, at the discount rate of 7.5%, the value of a farm generate $50, profit, $50 of profit for first year, prothom bachure kotse, $100 profit for second year, and $150 profit for third year. Full stop. That farm sold. That farm sold. That farm sold. Eight hundred dollar product. That farm sold. Eight hundred dollar product. At the end of third year. that farm sold 800 dollar product at the uh, at the end of third year so again i uh, repeat again and uh, that is at the discount rate of 7.5 percent the value of a farm generates 50 dollar of profit for first year Hundred dollar of profit for second year and hundred fifty dollar of profit for third year. That farm sold eighty um, uh, eight hundred dollar of product at the end of third year. Full stop. What what is the present value for that farm? What is the present value for that? What is the present value for that farm? What is the present value for that farm? Okay. So I'm not going to present value maths for both. Our age, Jita make a total cost of Katha Bole Felici. So I made it taken a mention for a meta of Arthur slide a chola jabo, check number catch for both. टेड फ्रम ए फ्रम ए फांगशन हुई इज टोटल रेभिन्यू माइनस टोटल कस्ट इट हम प्रफिट 
प्रफिट ना फर दोटल for the second year is total revenue is 150 dollar for third year is 20 dollar and if i talk about the costing then uh, we use this formula jekhane amar kintu tr minus tc theke we have to find out the profit then we can solve uh, this problem so amra ekhon amader slide ami ar ekta whiteboard share korchi jekhane amra maths ta solve korbo tala onek ta shadow clear hobe so ekhane amake ja ja dawa chilo एंड When there is any kind of uh, a discount rate or interest rate, it's a 0.075. common thing. For, yeah, it's a common thing for us. We have to convert it on decimal. So you have to di divide it by hundred. So when you convert it in uh, in decimal, the answer is seven point zero seven five. Is it? Yes, ma'am. So uh, I did a mistake. It's denoted by small r. The camera small r there mentioned. Okay. Then the number of years. It was bola chhe. Ekne koi ta boshra katha mentioned kora chilo. Three years. I mean, it amre kru likhe rakho. Tha tamato shubhi thabe. So here the here the number of years which is denoted by small n. Yes, three years. Okay. Ah, uh, then they mention the cost. Ah, uh, sorry. Then they mention the profit for each year. Say, for example, the profit for year. One अच्छा अभी year one लिख लाम because अम्म first year बोल लो अनेक अम्म first year बुझे मैं first year second year तो ये जो ना year one टा लिख लाम so it's denoted by pi and unfortunately there is no pi sign here अम्म ये टके एक तो draw करने से सामने टके भी देखो जो तो year sorry draw करो हाँ so ये टके जो तो year अम्म ना pi टा लिख बो pi टा लेखा पढ़े होते हैं ये चेष्टा कर
again here we find out the year two so the second year data power which will be denoted by pi two pi niche two to hobby lower caps data camera lower caps the shabby can I make a papo they call to had looks very odd i use pink color but it has the chocolate for a currently use for she the booster button so then 100 then in the same way the profit for year three again i will try to draw it using pink that pink color again um, be denoted by the pi 3 and which is 150 taka hundred fifty dollar so now they uh, um, ask you to find out the present value so as you know present value means it will be the sum of your expected future profits so I'm not formulating literally so the formula was like this that is the present value is equal which is denoted by pv pv is equal and uh, now i i use that draw thing again so pv is equal uh, this is the sum of using the summation sign this is the sum of expected future profit I mean, just a profit power future. So, like, I mean, nth year portion to jete pari. Expected future profit divided by one plus r, that is the discount rate for those year. That means nth year. I know I'm a handwriting could be pota hotse and I'm cook postokori electric board elixir. I hope up the data boost the person. Gina, what the seward? Only get that Hashaka who has shock or the Katsami to boost the person to eight to good, but eight signed our laptop or keyboard use for a lecker from Hobbaker and I'm here to hashok a symbol gula did. Ma'am, what file a colleague who to ma'am? Ah, I can monohotse jam you at a word file share code or a cotta. আচ্ছা যেটা এখানে করে ফেলেছি এটা করে নেক্সট আমরা ম্যাথসগুলো যখন করব তখন আমরা ওয়ার্ড ফাইলে চাপ ওকে সো এরপরে যেটা করব সেটা হচ্ছে গিয়ে তাহলে আমরা এখানে ইয়ার কয়টা পেলাম তিনটা বছর পেলাম সো আমরা তাহলে স্পেসিফিক তিনটা বছরের জন্য নিতে শুরু করব তো আমার যেহেতু এখানে লিখতে অসুবিধা তো আমি এখানে পাই এর এগেইনস্টে আই এম ইউজিং দা ওয়ার্ড হুইচ ইজ प्रॉफिट হ্যাঁ प्रॉफिटটা ইউজ করছে যাতে আপনারা বুঝতে পারেন so for first year it is a profit profit one niche that means first year profit profit one is divided by one plus r to the power t uh, that means the year one so here the time is one so we know uh, this triangle sign it's denoted the to the power uh, thing so i'm even one deal of at amra jani je when the power is one we don't need to mention that that's why i don't mention it here plus the uh, expected profit for year two so again profit two divided by one plus r to the power two. Plus for year three profit. Profit three for year three to be profit three. Profit three is divided by again one plus R three R to the power. আমি এটা জাস্ট একটু লিখে দেখানোর জন্য আবার একটু ড্র করে দেখাচ্ছি এটা ফর্মুলাটা আসলে অনেকটা এরকম ছিল যে লাইক দা পাই 1 পাই 1 मींस দা प्रॉफिट ফর ইয়ার 1 ডিভাইডেড বাই 1 প্লাস 
फिफ्टी <laughs> प्रफिट इज divided by same thing again 1 plus r here the r value is 0.075 to the power 2 so sure. r2 plus for year 3 the profit is 150 dollar which is divided by 1 plus R, which is point, the value is point zero seven five to the power. Can you hear the sound of raining? No, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Sundar Bishti. Chakal theke, ma'am. Ji, ma'am, dekho bachi. Kuch sundar Bishti hote. Acha. So. And third year, a hundred twenty point seven four. Ma'am, first year, the twenty eight point five seven or something. Let me check it again. I'm going to check it. Just ni ni lam. That the onora jodi na korte pare, just ekta ekta random value shampor ka idea. By jodi ni check. I'm going to need to check it. Calculator to dekh. Kabai kore, I'm going to try na lau kore. Okay. And first year, twenty eight. Point five seven or something. Second year same. Third year twenty eight point zero nine. Third year twenty eight point zero nine. Now, our kind of a answer is forty six point five one. Acha. Did Mr. Tucker question? It is to say no. It is just a quote. One plus point zero seven five. That means there are other add for it. So the answer is just one point zero seven five. Then what are they divide for? बेर कर 
0.75 কে কিউব বের করে নেব 2 টু দি পাওয়ার 3 যেটাকে কিউবটা বের করে নেব দেন ইউ ইউ হ্যাভ টু ডিভাইডেড ইট বাই দা 150 সো দা টোটাল ভ্যালু ইজ ভলেন্স আর 253.78 माल्टिप्लीकेट so here if we can find out the present value we form jera kotha bolchen seta present value already 253 dollar or almost 254 dollar so jodi ei farm ta amar future e bhabe profit make korte thake tahole amar dekha jabe je ami kintu amar optimum je position ta kintu ami je present e amar je resource gulo ache seta jodi ami properly use kore actually amra decision ta ekhon theke ashbe shetai bolchi so if i use my resources properly Uh, in that cases, amra each year ei dhorne profit make korte pa. Like fifty dollar, hundred dollar, second year jonno, third year is hundred fifty dollar. Ei bhabe jodi amra fourth year er jonno jekhon sheta jonno kintu amra profit calculation korte ashte pa. Uh, okay, so now let's talk about uh, that is the application of uh, this uh, theory. That is the theory of farm. Ma'am, ma'am, uh, ita je uh, farm sold eight hundred dollar. ওটা কেন ইয়া করা হইছে এটা মেটা আমি তো জাস্ট ওটা ওখানে মেটা আনলাম না আমি জাস্ট একটা ইনফরমেশন এক্সট্রা ইনফরমেশন দিয়ে রাখলাম তো এটাই বলতে চাচ্ছি যে আমি হয়তো অনেক সময় দেখা যায় যে টোটাল রেভিনিউটাও দেই এই যে আমাদের যে সেকেন্ড যে ফর্মুলাটাকে ভাঙলে আমরা পাচ্ছি যে प्रॉफिट ইজ इक्वल टू টোটাল রেভিনিউ মাইনাস টোটাল কস্ট সো ইন সাম কেসেস আই মেনশন দা টোটাল রেভিনিউ এন্ড দেন আস্ক ইউ টু ফাইন্ড আউট দা প্রেজেন্ট ভ্যালু সো যদি এমন হয় যে আমি বলে দিলাম ফর ইচ ইয়ার দা কস্টিং ইজ लिखेगुल ম্যাথস করার সময় সাইন সিম্বল ইউজ করবেন কিনা যদি এমন হয় যে एग्जामটা আপনি মানে জাস্ট হ্যান্ড রিটেন দিবেন সো ইন দ্যাট কেসেস আই প্রেফার রাইট ডাউন দা সিম্বল সিম্বল গুলো দিবেন এট প্লেস হ্যাঁ কিন্তু যদি আপনি ওয়ার্ডে যে আমার মত করে কষ্ট করে ডক ফাইলে লেখা শুরু করলেন তখন এত কষ্ট করে সিম্বল না দিলেও হবে ঠিক আছে তখন হচ্ছে গিয়ে মানে শর্টেস্ট ওয়েতে দেখিয়ে দিন কিন্তু যখন ম্যাথসটা স্টেপ গুলো থাকে স্টেপ গুলো একটা আমি যখন যতই ঝামেলা হোক আমি কিন্তু স্টেপ গুলো লিখে দিই তো স্টেপ গুলো দিবেন একটা সিম্বলের জায়গাটা আমি হয়তো স্কিপ করে দিলাম আচ্ছা আমরা লাস্ট থিংটাতে যাব দ্যাট ইজ দা আমরা দেখব যে আমরা হচ্ছে গিয়ে হোয়াট আর দা লিগ্যাল কনস্ট্রেন্ট ইন আ বিজনেস আমরা বিজনেসে আমরা কিছু লিগ আমরা কিছু কনস্ট্রেন্ট ফেস করি আমরা যখনই একটা বিজনেসে যাচ্ছি बैरियर्स Okay. Before starting that, uh, we have uh, Ahmed. Can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Uh, do you have any problem? Like I solve a problem about the present value. Do you get it? Yes, ma'am. I got it. Okay. Thank you. So when we start a business, we face some constraint. That means we uh, there are some barriers for us. So what are those, and how we are going to solve that? That's our last topic for from today's class. so the first constant we are facing that is the limited resources the thing i mentioned when i talk about the economic problem uh, managerial economic problem faces by a manager that was about uh, what we uh, why we are going to invest for labor or capital so actually it's related with the first constant which is limited resources yes 
again we have limited resource to uh, 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 for our production purposes that means this, that resources are a scary number obviously the number of skilled labor is uh, limited in for economy the raw materials or the energy that is the fossil fuel we have the, for the production purposes those are limited in nature so you have to find out which resources you are going to use so the easiest solution is if the economy is capital intensive then go for more mat raw materials and uh, uh, machineries thing then the labor and if the economy is labor intensive in that cases uh, uh, you uh, it's it would be beneficial for you if you use more labor so for example when we uh, in Bangladesh, our maximum product is labor intensive, like ready-made garments, agri product, manufacturing product. We don't go for computer production or car production because those are capital intensive product and capital, which means technology or machineries, we, uh, that is very expensive to our country. But if you build up your farm on Germany or a European country, in that case is you will go for labor, uh, capital intensive product like the machine, uh, uh, like the computer production or car production, because on those country, their population is too low if you compare it with Bangladesh. And uh, their, uh, the product, uh, they have uh, latest technology. So their capital is cheaper than labor. Okay. Then uh, quality requirement, yes. The resources we're going to use, uh, we need to maintain the sort of quality. And after the production, you have to uh, uh, we have to check out Amiki desired quality product. There is a wing in any in, in, in business that is the quality control uh, uh, quality control section. Ami quality control so, I'm a product curriculum, but it mean uh, it doesn't maintain the uh, uh, quality standard. I'm a product can to sell hobby. So then the second concern we're facing that is the quality requirements. So you have to make sure that the resources you are using, that is the input you are using, that is uh, 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 that has some sort of quality which you uh, you need, and the product you are producing that's also meet up the quality standard for your customer. Uh, then labor uh, labor constant yes when you go for the labor intensive product there are some labor constant which is actually mostly uh, which is related with uh, their maximum wage their uh, their fringe benefits amra jokhon labor hire kori oder wage er sathe tader ke kichu benefits dite it's called fringe benefits so for example the transportation service or a meal like apni lunch meal dicchen ki na ba snacks dicchen ki na do, uh, do they get uh, uh, vacation uh, then holidays gulo ki bhabe dicchen e gulo ke amra boli fringe benefits so ami jokhon labor niye kaaj korbo amar business e to obviously kichu we need some labor so we have to think about the labor con uh, contracts and this labor contracts actually related with their wage and their fringe benefits okay and the last thing is Legal, con uh, legal restriction, which is mostly uh, taken by government. And uh, some, uh, sometimes there are some uh, government laws and restriction for the production purpose. For example, maybe some uh, government uh, put some restriction on, on your waste management. That means why you can dump your wastage or they ask you to maintain some, uh, maintain some minimum wage. Uh, like in Bangladesh for government sector, there is a minimum wage, which is at least five, you have to pay 5,000 taka per labor. So that's the uh, legal restriction by government. So uh, when you go for a, a government business, you have to follow that. So this is kind of some restriction that um, or some barriers. So like I'm a business start for it. See, I'm government's a business. Again. So maybe I don't make any uh, in first year. I don't make any profit, but uh, how many uh, uh, how many numbers of buyers I'm hiring here? I have to pay at least five thousand taka per month to them because it's a it's a legal restriction by our government. And we So uh, that's a problem. Um, but only case that property costs in a government pay that costs. So I'm going to get a problem. Because I'm going to maintain because those are my government rules, and I have nothing to do. 
So these are some constraints uh, which uh, we will face uh, uh, when we start the business. Uh, then our communication problem which we need. So finally, what we have learned from this chapter. From this chapter, we have learned uh, that is, uh, we have learned that is uh, the scope of managerial economics. That means where we can use uh, uh, our uh, this subject. Then we find out is there any difference between economics and managerial economics. Then we develop our first theory uh, uh, from the managerial economics, which is uh, theory of farm. Uh, then we get to know about some a legal constraint and finally that's the wrap up uh, portion okay nahid raised his hand okay nahid ma'am our attendance needs to see them ami ajke ekhono attendance nei ni ekhono attendance nei ni ami ekhon just nibo ami eta ekhon emni nei nichi amar just hocche acha ekhono attendance attendance nei ni eta kichu kotha so चैप्टर the second chapter is from today's class which is uh, which will follow uh, the reference uh, that is the chapter 1 from the uh, your reference book that is my khurshi see ar apni ekto koshto kore dui ta reference er je dui ta chapter dui ta different different boi theke dui ta chapter porechhe to ekto likhe ekta detail post kore deben class test ta syllabus ta ke okay and class okay. ha next week er second class e nibo ফার্স্ট ক্লাস টানা প্রথমে সকালে ক্লাস শুরু করব আমাদের তো দুটো লেকচার একসাথে কভার করা আছে সেকেন্ড লেকচার मींस আফটার 9:30 সো ইওর ক্লাস টেস্ট উইল ক্লাস টেস্ট উইল স্টার্ট फ्रॉम 9:30 টু 10:30 হয়তো 1 আওয়ার টাইম দিব সাবমিট করার জন্য এটা ম্যাম একটা কোশ্চেন ছিল আপনি যে বলছেন ম্যাম প্লাগারিজম পুরোপুরি প্রোহিবিটেড সেই ক্ষেত্রে ম্যাম লাইক কোশ্চেন আসলো ডিফারেন্স বিটুইন ইকোনমিক্স এন্ড ম্যানেজারিয়াল ইকোনমিক্স তো আপনি যেগুলো পড়েছেন এগুলোই তো লিখবো ম্যাম তাহলে মানে আমরা একটু কনসেপচুয়াল লেখা যায় না প্যারাফ্রেজিং করা যায় না যেখানে একদমই দেখবেন যে কপি করতে হচ্ছে যেখানে দেখবেন যে এক কপি করতেই হচ্ছে কপি মিন্স হচ্ছে যেটা হয়তো হুবহু আমি ইনফরমেশন গুলো পাচ্ছি ইন দ্যাট কেস ইজ ট্রাই টু প্যারাফ্রাইজ দে আমি দেখবেন যে আমি কিন্তু বড়নোর সময় নিজের মতো করে দুই তিনটা লাইন বলে দিয়েছি কনসেপ্ট কিন্তু সেমই থাকছে কিন্তু একটু ঘুরিয়ে বলছি এবারে একটু ঘুরিয়ে বলেন তাহলে কিন্তু প্যাগারিজম চেকার এটা যায় না চেষ্টা করব না মানে আপনাদের যেটা দেখা যায় যেটাও দেখাতে পারলে ভালো হতো আমি যখন কোশ্চেন সাবমিট করি ওখানে একটা অপশন থাকে চেক দা প্যাগারিজম আমি ওটা তো সব সময় ক্লিক করি মানে এটা সব পেজেরই করে তো ওখানে আপনি যখন অ্যানসারটা সাবমিট করেন আমি যখনই ওটা ওই প্যাগারিজম চেকারে যে চলে যাই সেটাতে হচ্ছে কি আমাকে পার্সেন্টেজটা দেখা যায় কত परसेंट প্যাগারাইজ আর আমার ল্যাপটপে আমি হচ্ছে আলাদা ভাবে গ্রামারলি হচ্ছে ইনস্টল করা मोहम्मद ID two zero one zero zero seven zero zero two. Muhammad yeah. Manzurul Islam. Yes, ma'am. Sayed Azmatul Kadir. Yes, ma'am. Ah, uh, Muhammad Golam Sarwar. Yes, ma'am. Imran Hussain Rani. Yes, ma'am. Muhammad Raihanul Mubarak. Yes, ma'am. Muhammad uh, Shakil. Yes, ma'am. Tanvir Islam Noman. Yes, ma'am. Ahmed Sheikh. Yes, ma'am. Shagur Kumar Dash. Yes, ma'am. Farhana Akhtar. Yes, ma'am. Saiful Islam. Yes, ma'am. Mehdi Hasan. Yes, ma'am. Nahid Hasan Khan. Nahid Hasan Khan. 
Abdul Kader. Yes, ma'am. Nahid bin Hussein. Yes, ma'am. Rana Ahmed. Yes, ma'am. Okay, is there anyone who attend my last class but miss it when I took it manually? Just raise yes, your hand, I, I will count that. Okay, Nahid bin Hussain. Okay, is there anyone who missed my last class attendance? You, you, uh, you already attend the class, but uh, you miss it when I took it manually. Okay, Abdul Kadir Zilan. Sir, what is your ID tech to bolben? Ma'am, 212. Mm -hmm. 005012. 5012, Jim. Okay, so then see you on the next class. In next class, we will uh, next class take to bhalo moto preparation because um, uh, economic optimization the chapter jabo, there will be a lot of maths. Um, uh, maths kora, man, next annual economics on a math put the high eta hot up a meet soon ashen. So next class take up the meet a chola jabo or third. I'm actually emotionally, ma'am. Dotovar and Yashin, ma'am. আচ্ছা ম্যাথস এ যদি আপনারা ওকে হন আমার জন্যই বেটার মানে আমি ম্যাথস স্কুল আসলে শেখাতেই চাই সো দেখা যাবে যে আমরা বেশ মজার মজার কিছু ম্যাথস করব ক্যালকুলাস এর কিছু পার্ট করব যেটা হচ্ছে গিয়ে দেখা যাবে অন্য কোন কোর্সে শিখবেন না ক্যালকুলাস এর কিছু থিওরিস থেকে আমরা হচ্ছে টোটাল কস বা টোটাল রেভিনিউ হিসেবে ক্যালকুলেশনে যাব তো আমার পার্সোনালি পছন্দ এবং ইজি দেখা যাবে ম্যাথস স্কুলও পারলে দেখা যায় মার্কসটা ভালো মার্কসটা ক্যারি করাটাও ইজি হয় আমাদের জন্য তো আমরা সেটা চেষ্টা করব ম্যাম থিওরি থেকে ম্যাথসই মজা না কি মানে ওইটাই বলছি কম্পারেটিভলি কিন্তু এই যে যেমন আমি একটা क्वेश्चन যদি করি যে এক্সপ্লেইন দা লিগ্যাল কনস্ট্যান্ট হুইচ ইউ আর গোইং টু ফেস অ্যাজ আ অন্টারপ্রেনর এটা লিখতে আপনার যত কষ্ট হবে তার থেকে যদি আমি এন্ড প্রেজেন্ট ভ্যালু থেকে একটা ম্যাথস দেই তাহলে কম সময় লাগবে দেখা যাবে যে মার্কিংটাও ভালো হবে भलो And stay safe, stay home. Seriously, the COVID-19 situation is not okay in our country. So wherever you are, kindly stay at home. Okay, ma'am. Get well soon. Allah Hafiz. Ma'am, exam ki ma'am MCQ ho ver na ki. Na MCQ na. Semi broad type of question ko. Okay, ma'am. Assalamualaikum. Okay. Waalaikum assalam. Assalam, ma'am. Assalamualaikum.